of the Dallas shoes. However, so we're going to inhale and take the right leg and bring the right foot in front of the right of the left foot. Stand nice and tall. Pelvis slightly tilted forward, shoulders relaxed. It's a balanced pose. It's like being on a balanced beam. If you've seen those girls, you can continue to have your hand on the chair. You're breathing nice and deeply through your nose. With every exhale, the body relaxes more into the pose. One more inhale, grab your chin, you're going to let go of it, and at the exhale, release with that leg. Right leg back, shake the left leg, shake the right leg, shake the left leg again. Go back to center. We'll open up the right knee out, we'll take the left heel and press it into the right ankle, to the left ankle. So we're feeling a nice little stretch here on the inner thigh. We're again standing nice and tall, holding on to the chair. We extend on top. This is tree pose. You can do this leaning against the wall for more support. And it's a balance pose, and you know it changes. Balance changes daily. So we do the best we can. If you want to take your hands off the chair, you can do so. You don't need to. You can continue to hold. You're still balancing. You're still working that balance gene. That gets one, one more breath. Exhale, bring that knee down. Then we're going to lift the right knee. We're going to drop it and bring the foot back and try to touch your glute with the foot. It may not happen, but you get a really big stretch on your quads. Inhale and up. And the hamstring, sit back. Inhale up. And exhale back. Inhale up, exhale back, inhale up, exhale back, last time, inhale up, exhale back, and bring that foot down. And then again, we'll take the right knee up, then we're going to open it up to the side, and back to center, and open, and center, and open, and center. And open, center, and last time open, center, and release down. Really, lots of big muscle groups. We're warming up. You should feel some level of sensation on both legs. So then we're going to separate our feet hip width apart. The left hand goes on the chair. We're going to inhale, right arm up. Exhale, lean over towards the chair. Inhale up. Exhale up. Inhale up, lift the arm and look up at the fingers. Exhale over to the left. Inhale up. Exhale down. One more time. Inhale up and stretch. Exhale over to the side. Inhale up. Exhale down. We're going to bring the left foot in. The right foot goes out, but the foot is flat on the floor. You're going to inhale left, right heel up, exhale down. Inhale up, exhale down. Inhale up, exhale down. Inhale up, exhale down. One more way, inhale up, exhale down. Then just keep. Exhale, we'll come back to center. Feet are together, hip width apart, but we're going to lift both heels up and down. Both heels come up and down. Then heels up and down. Inhale up and down. Inhale up and down. Inhale up. Down and last time, inhale up and double step back with the left leg. Same thing, the right leg is bent and towards the front. The left leg is straight back. Then we'll inhale the left heel up. Exhale down. Inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale up. Exhale down, inhale up. Exhale down, last time up. 
and down and keep it there for breath or two, feeling that calf really stretching. And then the next inhale, step forward. And then we're going to step away, feet are separated, hip width apart. I'm going to fall through the, put our head through the center of the arms, bring the belly in with a flat back, really pushing out with the hips. So we want to feel that stretch back here and in the arms and in the upper, upper back. Bring the belly in to support the lower back. It's a version of downward dog. Bends and knees, but the knees are bent slightly. We're breathing. One more breath, and then exhale slowly. Come up. So now the right arm is on the chair. And we'll do that. So standing balance poses on this side. So we'll take the left leg out, put it in front of the right foot, standing nice and tall. The pelvis comes out a little. Shoulders are relaxed. Hand is on the chair. We focus on a point in front of us to keep us focused. And we breathe through the nose, into the nose, out through the nose. Try to make the breath nice and long, healing those exhales. Really relaxes us. Inhale up, exhale down, and last time, inhale up, 
and stretch, and exhale over, inhale up, and exhale down. We're going to come back to the back of the chair. The arms length away. We're going to take the right leg and bring it around and behind the left leg to the other side. So cross your feet, the right leg behind the left. You're going to take your hips and push them out. And if, if, if your chair is not too heavy, you can push the chair away so that you can lean forward. A few breaths, noticing the sensation on the legs and on the hips and on the lower back. Try to bring your belly in and see how that feels. Breathing. One more breath. And then exhale, we'll slowly back across the legs and come up. And see how that feels. Arms are a little tired, so let's do some arm circles going forward. And then going backwards. And then we're back to the chair. Back and take the left leg and bring it across to behind on the other side of the right foot. And lean forward, push the hips out. Lower. Today's code word is chair. C H A I R. Chair. Remember to log your code word today. Chair, and we'll come back to standing. 